This is the ES300. This is one of our food cycler models that we've installed here at Farm Boy Cornwall. This model is actually capable of processing about 500 pounds of food waste a day. Through that cycle, we will be able to reduce the original mass and volume of the food waste by about 90%. That remaining 10% residual is actually a soil amendment that you can then take and reapply back into the farm to grow more food. So we've really created a table to farm, farm to table circular economy with this technology. When you're able to take 500 pounds of food waste and then come in in the morning and have a handful of dirt left over, it's a pretty interesting thing and we're generally able to create excitement fairly quickly with that. You're taking something that you used to just throw in the trash essentially and are able to now give it new life and you're able to sell a new product. The way that we deal with our organic waste now by sending it to landfill, it's not broken down, it's not being reused and this is locking up nutrients that can otherwise be used as a soil amendment or fertilizer. When you have uh, trimmings that aren't usable such as the outside peel of pineapples, food waste that'll come in that is potentially expired or starting to rot, it's just straight into the trash and then into the compactor. Food waste accounts for 193 million tons of greenhouse gas emissions in Canada alone each year. That's the equivalent of 41 million cars running consistently for an entire year. With the food cycle, you're actually able to process the majority of that waste on site and actually turn that into a commodity that can be reused again. As the produce waste is run through the food cycler, it heats up and dehydrates the food waste. So this significantly reduces the weight by evaporating off a significant portion of water that's typically trapped in produce waste. No longer are you trucking water and waste from point A to point B, you're actually taking it and processing it on site. The equipment itself is very easy to use. You basically set aside everything that you want to incorporate and run through the food cycler, and then you just put it in the top hatch, close it up, and then you just run it. It's pretty straightforward. This is an aerobic digestion process, and in doing that, the methane gas emissions are eliminated. Methane gas is often the smell that is associated with food waste, and that's one of the reasons why we're able to process food waste on site, indoors, without any risk of odor. Once we're able to show the added benefit of this technology, it should be easy to adopt on a much broader scale. We believe that Farm Boy set an example not only for other grocery stores, but also for their customers on the different ways that you can be handling food waste at home and in back of house here at store.